hey youngster, so if I was 19 or 20 going back and I was thinking about or considering being a realtor, first and foremost, I would do one thing. I would find probably the number one or the number five, one through five realtor in my town and call them. I would pick them up and cold call them. So first off, if you can't do that, real estate's probably not going to be for you. That's your first test, right? And so once you've called this top producer, I'd say, hey, I'm young, I'm hungry, I'm 19, 20, whatever age it is, and I wanna know if I can come work for you, intern with you, chateau you for at least two months, you know, three days a week. I wanna come and see what a real life looks like for a realtor because I see this million dollar listing, I see all these DIYs, I see all these house hunters, and it looks simple, but I want reality before I go and waste time taking a test and paying all these fees and getting into a career that I may hate. And so my, my advice to you would be, go find the top producer and actually see if this is the true career path because it all looks fun, but it is hard work. And I think what you'll see is you'll either see it is hard work, but I want it, or it's a lot of hard work and I don't want it. And I hate for you to have to go through this process of getting your license and spending time getting your license and then paying all these fees to learn that you hate it. All that's doing is wasting your time and that's all we got. And so uh, call the top producer and if you don't have the guts to call the top producer, it's gonna be tough for you to talk to someone who wants to sell a half a million dollar home. So you're probably gonna lose in this anyways and it's probably not the right career at this time. So call the top producer, go there minimum of two to three days a week and do it for two months straight and then analyze if this is the right move for me, then go take your real estate exam, then do the classes, then pay the fees and join a brokerage.